So the long journey to the summit of European football starts with the opening fixture of the Champions League. The atmosphere, the sense of expectation, fevered, frenetic. This is the one fixture they all wanted to see, and every day has only fanned the flames of expectation. The instantly recognisable sound of the UEFA Champions League anthem, the perfect backdrop to this eagerly awaited night of European football. So off we go then. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Well, I'm going to go for the little wriggler. That is Raheem Sterling. World-class Karim Benzema! And some of the best managers I played for insisted on starting games as you mean to go on. And we've just seen a very important opening goal from an extremely talented individual who looks primed for more. He really does look at it. Simon Mignolet did well the first time, nothing he could do about the follow-up. Well, for me, that's just pure predatory brilliance. It's not so much the finish, but the way he read the situation when nobody else was even alert to it. That's fantastic. Well, that has certainly made things interesting. Philippe Coutinho. Sterling. Now it's Balotelli. Kadira. And it's Benzema. Colo Toure. Lucas. Balotelli. Lucas. Gerard. Who's going to make this theirs? Looks like a good ball through. Bale. Looks to slip it through. It's got through to him. Benzema. Colo Torre gets good distance on it. Real Madrid making the ideal start. It is something to build on. Always when you score early, it gives you such a lift and it, it casts doubt in the minds of your opponents at the same time. And that pretty much sums up the difference in what we've seen. One team assured, the other a little unsure. It's bounced back off the post. And the referee has brought play back and shown him a yellow card. Timely intervention. Tony Kroos boots it upfield. And it's Coutinho. He's off on a marauding run. Just swings wide. Oh, it was almost a beautifully placed shot. He's so unlucky not to see that go in. Tony Kroos, they scored inside the first 10 minutes to give them a 1-0 lead. Here it comes. Time to deliver. Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo! And in it goes. And with that goal comes comfort. Wonderful stuff, and it was all about quick thinking and even quicker feet, but you have to ask questions as to how he got through.
Real Madrid take a two-goal lead and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Balotelli with the ball through. Now here's the through ball. Coutinho, can he find a finish now? In it goes! Back to within one! Interesting! Well, none of us were exactly sure how that was going to end up then, but I'm delighted to see such a, a happy ending after such a splendid dribbling run. I mean, he really did fool that defence into wondering what he was going to do next. We have got ourselves a game here. I think they can sense a comeback here and so can this crowd. It's all systems go now. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Benzema. It's Benzema! Mamadou Sacco can hoist it clear. The defence can get it clear. It's all a little short of forward momentum, lacking thrust. Lucas. So midway through the first half, and it is a tight old tie. Coutinho. Balotelli! That is Super Mario! And it's another really good show of character. I love the spirit and togetherness they muster. Never know when they're beaten. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out. Never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. We have ourselves a real game here. Yeah, we thought that this one would be close between two strong sides like this, and I think that just goes to prove it. Marcelo looking for options. Cristiano Ronaldo. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! Poorly directed kick from the keeper, he's given it away. Lucas. And it's Sterling. Now it's Balotelli. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Well, that was a really awkward one for the goalkeeper to deal with. Tries a through ball. And the whistle's gone, presumably for offside. Polo Toure, Sterling, now it's Balotelli. Oh, they've seen lots of the ball, time to go for it a bit, a bit of creativity and adventure. And it's Markovic. Loose ball, who's going to get there? Markovic passes it through. Marcelo, Kadira, Bale, Rafael Varane, Kadira, Marcelo, thrust towards the front line. And the whistle goes for half time. What a good half. They've gone blow for blow, and it's 2-2.
Second period then on the way. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Modric. Bale. Now the pass. And back out it comes. Tony Kroos. The ball has crossed the line and it's a throw. Benzema. Benzema has a go! He's got away with one there. And oh, he's got that completely wrong. Now it's Balotelli. And Pepe. Rafael Varane conjuring up some magic on the right-hand side. Tries a through ball. And he's there to get rid. And he has been fouled there. Modric, it's come through and he's had a quick look inside, and it's James Rodriguez, it's Cristiano Ronaldo, fair attempt, just the wrong outcome, well, if he hopes to do better than that, he's got to work on his technique and his timing. The contact wasn't right there, so there wasn't much chance of success. Oh, you could tell he really wanted that. Yeah, he's definitely a player who looks like he could make something happen every time he's on the ball. He's just full of belief and energy. And he won't reach that. Checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. Gerard. now it's Balotelli. Sergio Ramos charges in. Lucas with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. And he's going to have his name taken. Gets it, and now what? Ball's loose, who's getting there? Balotelli passes it through. A slightly better ball would have led to a very different outcome there. By taking that route into a central position, he made it easier for the defence. Bale... Going full steam down the flank. Now the cross. He's dealt with that well. Balotelli absolutely focused then on the defensive side of his game. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team really, your striker should be the first line of that defence and, and he's delivering. Cristiano Ronaldo goes through the middle. Goal! Real Madrid! And they get themselves in front! That's always a great sight, you know, on a football pitch. Nimble footage, show great balance and a really cool head to finish. And that kind of dribbling is really smart. going to be a change here there's a man waiting to come on 
Real Madrid go into the lead. Listen, it's no surprise to me as to who scored the goal when you look through this team. He's the stand. No, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. Casillas deals with it effortlessly. Daniel Carvajal. Bale. Carvajal with the ball through. Cristiano Ronaldo. It's a brilliant interception. A chance to play it in. Cristiano Ronaldo. Back of the net! Simon Mignolet perhaps deserves a little bit of sympathy here because that's a goalkeeper's nightmare. It's, it's clear that the keeper was unsighted by his defence and by the time he picked up the flight of that, it was too late. He snaffles his third and that earns him the match ball. That defence must be sick of the sight of him. He's been persistent and ruthless all game. He just hasn't stopped working. Real Madrid take a two-goal lead and are looking good for the win. Now it's Philippe Coutinho. Philippe Coutinho floats one over. Daniel Carvajal. Now it's Balotelli and it's Jose Enrique. Coutinho. Well, he would surely have scored there more times than not. Marcelo. Philippe Coutinho. Crunching tackle. Coutinho looks like a good ball through. Here it comes. Has he found his man? Benzema, that intervention was very necessary. Allen. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. Bale. Benzema tries to get it forward quickly. Cristiano Ronaldo. Lovely feet. And that is that. Well, that's the way to launch the campaign. Now they can look ahead with confidence and comfort. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Well, pressure can quickly build on you if a positive result isn't achieved in your opening group match. Instead, they can take great confidence now from a very good victory and look ahead with real belief.